Wow, that's amazing. How about the phase two? Uh, during phase two, we'll be focused on integrating businesses to run a coin. What exactly should be done to the person who is watching this interview and doesn't want to like, comment, share, or subscribe? Shoot him. Hi, what's up, everybody? Welcome once again to another comic interview with Danny211. Today I'm so excited because I'm having one of the most influential human beings on this planet. But first, before we move on with the interview, if you are already a subscriber, thank you so much. If you are new here, hit that subscribe button on your right hand side. Give a thumb up and leave a comment below. Thank you so much. Good morning, Akon. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Akon. How do you feel having you today on my show? It's a pleasure. When last did I have one on one shot with you? Two years ago. Yes, sure, it has been quite a long time. Uh, now tell me what you have been doing. I mean, plans, business, or any other thing. Since then, I've continued to build on my philanthropic and business ventures to launch Acon City. To the people who might be hearing Acon City for the first time, could you please elaborate more to them? A sustainable smart city built in 2,000 acres. Where? Of Senegal's coastline. Where exactly in Senegal is it located? Uh, you know, it's near Dakar, not too far from the International Airport. That's a huge piece of land. If I may ask, who gave this land to you? I mean, who is that person who can give such piece of land to a single person? And it was gifted to me by the president of Senegal, Mr. Marky Sall. Oh, you must be the most blessed person to own such an unbelievable city. So, how far would the project as per now? Uh, see, we have about six billion contractors to begin phase one of Akon City, which includes the construction of roads, uh, state of the arts hospitals, residential hotels, a large shopping mall, police station, uh, schools, uh, waste management, and solar power plants. Wow, that's amazing. How about the phase two? Uh, during phase two, we'll be focused on integrating businesses to run Acoin and completely and complete the constructions of parks, stadiums, universities, and industrial complexes. What exactly is your vision for this wonderful futuristic city? Uh, see, my vision for Akon City, uh, you know, I can say my other African-based investments and ventures supports my belief that Africans' potential is endless, and of course, we've been waiting to unlock that. We have the right of, you know, we have all the capabilities, resources, strength, manpower, I mean, to succeed. I mean, you all know how that goes. One may not actually understand it and believe it that it will surely happen. So how is that possible? Uh, we just need the proper vision and framework to uh, incentivize and reward innovation, uh, in, along with entrepreneurship, and convince uh, everyone else to build that confidence within themselves for Africa. Personal as Akon, you may have a goal as everybody else. So what's the main goal you always want to see accomplished? Essentially, giving the people of Africa the tools to fish, produce, and develop their own. You know what I mean? So that's my main goal. You also came up with Acoin, a cryptocurrency. What exactly triggered that idea? On Acoin, uh, the idea for Acoin uh, came to me as I returned to France. And I realized I was at the airport trying to exchange my monies and they wouldn't accept the CFA, which was like crazy. I mean, like the French created and printed this money for us, but yet it had no value in France. So it was like, that was a time when I realized something had to be done. Uh, and it, that's just what it was. So this is why when I realized that Acon City needs to have its own uh, decentralized board, borderless currency. Uh, wow, wow, wow. And for you viewers who don't know exactly what cryptocurrency is, comment below and you will definitely be answered. And now your head correct. You said it. Econ, do you believe that this type of currency will have positive impact on Africa? In, in many ways, blockchain and cryptocurrency could be the savior for Africa. I really truly believe that. When exactly did you start investing in Africa? I have been investigating, uh, I'm sorry, investing in Africa since 2004, like since my first record locked up. So the little monies I've received, I just started investing because I saw that Africa would be the future. And I firmly believe that the greater the risk, clearly the greater the reward. And believe me, it is a big risk. 
back then, but today I don't think it's such a big risk. It's, it's evident that all roads leads to Africa in the future. This Econ City is the biggest investment that a normal human being can imagine. What can you say about it? Uh, um, but as Acon and Acoin um, are my most ambitious ventures to date, but this is initially a six billion dollar investment. That it, and it is, so it demonstrates that I am not alone in believing that Africa is right for investment on the brink of breakthrough. And I am for the stars, and I mean I'm I'm literally aiming for the stars right now. But if I reach the sky, I'm cool with that. Like I'm happy with that. But I will reach the galaxy. Believe me when I tell you. My legacy hopefully will speak for itself. Apart from this biggest city project, what biggest thing have you ever achieved? In the early days, I recognized in the Guinness. I was recognized in the Guinness Book of World Records uh, as the top-selling artist of master ringtones. And about the Guinness Book of World Record. So, so many ringtones all over the world. They actually put me on the Guinness Book of World Records, which was amazing. What other ambitions do you have apart from this economic transformation? Um, besides economic gain. New technologies and innovations have the potential to bring transparency and eliminate much of the corruption that's killing Africa's development. Thank you so much for taking your time and I hope people now viewing this and people watching it have picked something from this interview. So what else do you want to add on? So thank you for inviting me to speak and I look forward to working towards achieving the UN Sustainable uh, Development Goals and further develop the blockchain and cryptocurrency ecosystem in Africa. And her, hopefully with your, you guys' help and everyone that sees these opportunities at the moment when they believe it's relevant, uh, you know, come join me. And I think this will be something you won't regret and it will be something that will help to steady uh, 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 fast your, your, your family's legacies from your children to their children and beyond. I am so glad to have you today. Any last word to the viewers? So thank you guys for uh, listening and uh, tuning in. I appreciate it. Peace. What exactly should be done to the person who is watching this interview and doesn't want to like, comment, share, or subscribe? Shoot him. See you on the next video. Always wear your mask. Corona is fucked up. Peace.